welcome back to my channel it's me Zoe um yeah I know I am not looking through right now I literally only have mascara and chapstick on <laughs> and I'm wearing a t-shirt I normally wear t-shirts but normally I wear makeup on than this um but yeah so today's video is going to be really fun I'm going to be redoing parts of my room for uh school because my school year starts on August 30th so um that's literally in eight days so a little over the, a week so yeah that's great um yeah so um i guess without further ado let's just go ahead we're gonna i'll just do preface we're gonna um redo some shelving things do some like uh stationary stuff and we're gonna redo my ipad for school so as well as my computer yeah so thank you all for watching and let's go ahead and get into it okay so basically right next to my bed i have my little desk and like school area um so it's already set up already but not really how i want it to be so yeah i just have this chair usually there's a blanket on it but i'm washing that right now um yeah i just have my little checklist sticky notes this is my like to-do list thing and then this is my ipad case because i'm filming my ipad and my apple pencil which i use for notes and then um have my phone which i don't use during school in my uh, laptop but yeah, over here in this little basket, which will be getting real nice and stuff, I just have my wireless earbuds, my watch, and my two pairs of glasses. Um, these are lip glasses <laughs> and chapsticks and um, water bottle over there. Um, yeah, then this is my like jar with pens, pencils, scissors, ruler, compass. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so yeah, this just goes on the little candle holder over here, but that's, it only fits if there's little candles on it, so that's off for now because I have a big one. Over here I just have my, like, um, uh, what are these, fountain pens, my wax melts, my lighters, my little dream fall thing, and yeah, my wax melter and candle. So this is, like, a little school area. Um, this desk is actually pretty big. I think it's two feet by four feet, so it's pretty big. Um, and it is, like... <laughs> four or five inches taller than normal desks. I made, I measured my, uh, my normal desk I have, um, normal height one, and I made this one a lot taller because I am tall, so six feet. Yeah, anyways, and on this side, we just have this little bucket with my random school stuff for now, like pens, pencils down there, notebooks, folders, like that, and then in this bucket, I have my books. Um, this is a vintage chair that we're refurbishing at some point. And this is my little messy desk, but this is my makeup desk, so I don't use this for school yeah don't mind that um but yeah it's basically this right here on is what we are revamping today and yeah so let's just go ahead and, go ahead and get started so as you saw i just put all those random pencils and pens in here which are these are all new um new ones and yeah so i grabbed this drawer from the kitchen and as well as this one because i'm going to separate my pens and pencils out so this is my other drawer with my other stuff so first we're just going to take out like my other utensil things and then in this little drawer i think we're going to put all my colored like colorful pens because i don't have that many so it should fit pretty well so like this then i'll also be putting any extra pens i have so like see how i have two of this blue one i put one in there and then filter through those filter through these and then i will do that for you Okay, 
Okay, so you just saw me organize these. So these are all my like everyday ones. And these are extras and colored pens. They're all gonna go up here, but this one is gonna go closer to me. This one's gonna stay back here. So I'm kind of like that. And then as you saw, I have my extra lid and erasers, and these are just gonna go under just in here somewhere. Um probably under my glasses. I can get them out, yeah. And yeah, I'll actually show you my glasses. It's not the pair. Um, so I do use reading glasses. Um, my I do have a prescription, but I don't have it yet. So what I get are the 1.25 magnification. If I can get these out, it's really hard to put hand. My goodness. Um, I had one and it just didn't work before. Let me grab these quick. Okay, I got them out. So these are the glasses. I had these before in one. Uh, 1.00 magnification and it wasn't right for me so I got another pair because it was also broke as well um, in 1.25 and yeah that's great so these are blue light reading glasses and these ones in here which I'm not going to show are just blue light glasses so I will be using these more if I'm like reading if I'm just playing a video game I'll probably end up using the other ones if I'm like doing schoolwork and stuff I'll be end up using these and this jar gets to go back to the kitchen so yeah then let's organize this stuff. So I'll put this back and come back to organize. Okay, so I have my Graph World index cards that, you know, I got if you watched my school supplies haul number two. And I also have my little box over here with my fountain pens and my glasses and other things. I'm actually going to take my electronic, like just blue glasses away because I'm not using those over here for school. But I will be keeping these things. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick these note cards, like in here like that just so i have easy access to them because they are for formulas and like diagrams and things for math and chemistry so yeah i'm also gonna put my uh, fountain pens in there my glasses the um glass cleaning cloth will go under there but then my pencil and stuff can go under there so basically this is my little set right here and i can put here we'll just do this there my little um earbuds can sit under there so like that so that will be that little area so maybe i don't know what i should do with this it kind of looks kind of awkward i'll probably end up moving my lip gloss somewhere else but for now it's just gonna stay like this so we'll actually do kind of like that a little like school supplies area and yeah these are gonna stay here for now but these are going to the end of August. I kept them out to use these packs up and they're only gonna be here until the second day of school. So this will be gone by the time they're gone. So this will not like stay here. But for now, it's just gonna go like this. For now, it's gonna go like that, but that will not be there when school starts, just to let you know. So yeah, and I will grab a little candle holder thing that will go back on there once I have a smaller candle on there again, which will be after that one, I probably think. So yeah, this is my school area for now and let's go check out my school supplies area. So as I just showed you, these are like my notebooks and things. I have three normal notebooks, um, two graph and one dotted, two folders, sheet protectors, and this just has my spelling list in it. Um, but yeah, so I'm me organizing these all into a like little bin I'll go grab, which is literally right here, this little bin, cute little bin. I got paint on it <laughs> when I was painting my room, but um, a different color before this, but yeah, so basically I'll be putting these school supplies in there and I will end up labeling them in the next clip. So we'll label them first and then put them in the bucket.
I just want to show y'all how I have my books organized. Like, here. It's basically English, um, Latin, English, Latin, math, and uh, chemistry down there where I'm sitting. Um, then right here we have English books and history books. So, yeah, it's a little dusty. I have not brushed this one off in a while. But yeah, that's my little setup. And on the bottom, there's just tech stuff and skincare extras. So yeah, then we have obviously this over here looking nice and it will be cleaned up a little more. But um, yeah, let's now get into my iPad customization. basically just removed the notes app thing because I don't really think I'll be needing that and I added in some um little files quick like shortcut so that I can just quick go to my academic planner which is switched the wrong way right now but yeah so anyways that way I can just quickly access that and I always have my little bible verse right here which is um let's see first Thessalonians 515 always seek to do good to one another and to everyone so worst of the day i guess but yeah i think that's gonna be it for customizing my ipad um, i honestly don't really do too much in that sense as like stuff but maybe i will okay well i don't use messaging much so i think i put that in there and then put this in here like there so i have notes app on quick on the hot bar so and over here is just like shopping and um, other stuff like that. So that's what I'm going to do for my iPad. But yeah, let's get into my room setup and what I'm going to do there if, if that's not okay, before. Okay, so now it's time to get into my MacBook customization. Let's get going.
as you can see, I changed all my like folder icons right here. I want to focus. Um, and I'm just gonna show you how to do this. Um, I learned this from Julia K. Crest. I also got the little side graphics from Julia K. Crest. This just ran off Pinterest, but these were from Julia K. Crest, her website. So all credits to her go into this on teaching me how to do this. So basically, you just go onto your thing, your press get info, and it'll come up to this little guy. You're gonna press on that. Before that, you're gonna go in here press command a and then command c go in here press that so it's highlighted and command b and it will change it obviously it's already like that but that's how i did it so yeah um anyways if i go into this one i have other folders in the, in the coffee one too as well so yeah basically this is my whole desktop or macbook setup sorry there's a cat hair on the screen but yeah that's that and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I enjoyed filming it. Um, yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one on Thursday. Bye!